This is the Powertrain Studio 20 from Valve Train Amplification, and it's an analog tube-powered monitor for use with digital effects processors and amp modelers. Built on a 6v6 power section, the Studio 20 is designed to give you all the response and feel of a traditional tube amp when you're using a modeler such as the Kemper or Line 6 Helix. To keep from coloring the sound and allow all of the distortion overdrive characteristics that you're getting from the modeler, whatever modeler you're using to come through, the Powertrain Studio 20 uses a 75 watt speaker. The cabinet's set up like a traditional guitar combo, so it accentuates all of the frequencies of the guitar range and gives a very familiar playing feel for those of you that are used to playing tube amps. Often that's something that's lacking when using a modeler with a full range cabinet. So enough talk, let's hear this thing. I have a Kemper profiler here set up with factory presets. These have not been doctored at all. They're just what you get out of the box. So let's start out with a clean tone. So I should also mention that all of the cabinet emulations have been left on. Our next preset has a lot of effects, so you can hear how this, uh, this sounds with plenty of effects. Let's go to something that has a bit more grit. The cabinet definitely has a feel like a guitar amp there when I was digging in. It was really uh, responding the way I would expect a traditional tube amp to respond. Uh, so it was it was very nice. <laughs> Let's check out another one that has a little bit more grit too. And something with even more gain. This is the Powertrain Studio 20, and it has more than enough volume to be able to go out and gig at a small club with. And if you're looking for more, there is also the uh, Stage 50 model, which is two 6L6s in the power section and features a 200 watt speaker. Once again, this is the Powertrain series from Valve Train Amplification, available as the Studio 20 and the Stage 50, and you can check them out at AmericanMusical.com.